Yo, what is going on guys? Bobby here and today we got another dope video for you guys. So today the new 8-bit star power came out and luckily we got it in our shop. So if we go to our shop over here, or sorry, to our brawlers and click on 8-bit, the star power is called Extra Life and what it is essentially is an extra life. When 8-bit is defeated for the first time in a round, he instantly resurrects. Now this is in all modes, including solo showdown. So essentially you get two lives in solo showdown, which is absolutely broken. We're gonna do one game in each mode. So Siege, Gem, Brawl Ball, uh, solo showdown and duo showdown. I want to show you guys just how broken this brawler is at the star power in all the modes Let's start the games and let's get into it Okay, so here we go. The first game we're gonna be doing is brawl ball now Our 8-bit is only like a hundred trophies, but we've played it on a mini and we've seen it a ton So we know exactly how to play it. We're gonna dominate this middle over here now Obviously 8-bit is super slow. He does get countered by throwers and we're facing two throwers But we shouldn't have that much difficulty here. So I think there's a primo over here We're just gonna melt him not even give him a chance to go near the goal. We're going to put the um, our turret right back here so that no one's able to get it. Now, it does take away from the other star power. It makes our turret way smaller, but I don't think it's that much of a difference, to be honest. We're going to disallow this dynamic to move up by any means. This primo is going to try and move to the left. We're just going to laser him. That's going to be an instant kill. And I mean, that's just going to be a quick goal. No one was even able to get near us in this mid. It's just totally, totally dominating over here. Now we put up our turret a little bit too high. The dynamic will be able to get us and the turret, but it shouldn't be that bad. Jigsaw is doing a pretty good job on lane over there. We're just going to laser this Primo over here. Very easy kill for us. Cartridge is holding down his lane. We're going to walk up very slowly, pass the ball up. We're going to try and take out the tick. We will be able to do so. And Jigsaw is going to try and trick shot. He's going to fail, but we're going to put that ball right in the net, and that is going to be the Brawl Ball game. So you guys saw just how easy it was for us to dominate that middle. Even against two Brawlers that counter us in Tick and in Mike, we were able to totally dominate. Nobody was able to challenge us in the middle. Let's move on to Gem Grab now and see what type of matches we can get. Okay, so here we go into the next game. It looks like we're going to be facing an 8-Bit and a Piper, which is going to be really difficult because obviously 8-Bit also gets countered by Piper. So let's see how we can do here. We're going to have to try and keep our distance as much as possible. Even though Piper can reach us, we just should stay as far as possible because we are slow and it gives us a really hard time juking the Piper. So we're able to pick up one kill over there. We are one shot to the Piper. We're going to be able to juke it. Oh, we just got out of the way from dying to that 8-bit. Uh, Only two more shots and we would have gone down. So we're just going to heal over here. Going to try and pinch the 8-bit. Not going to be able to, but we're going to be able to really easily take out this Primo. We're going to put this right over here, which is going to give us some extra damage, obviously. We're going to shoot over there. Gonna get that Piper low. If we can just hit one clip, we're gonna get any brawler we hit really, really low. So right there, we're gonna be able to back off that 8-bit. We're just gonna shoot down this middle so far. Was it, we're able to help take out that Primo. And I mean, we're just doing a great job at holding the mid over here. And again, if we die with the gems, it doesn't really matter because we're just gonna spawn back with our extra life. The Piper should be over there. Oh, one shot, okay. Jig almost went down. He's not gonna go down. We're gonna grab that kill. Oh, okay, I guess Cart's gonna get it. So again, we're doing really well. We haven't even died yet in the two games we've played, and 8-bit is so strong, you rarely, rarely die. And this just shows how OP the star power is. I'm gonna try and die on purpose just to show you guys what it's like. Come on, hit me. Okay, see, we're gonna go down. But then again, we spawn right back up and we're able to start firing. Same position we had when we, when we died. I mean, it's unreal, nobody can get by us. And I mean, with a brawler like this that does so much DPS, I don't know if that's the right star power for him, but I mean, it's Supercell's way of doing it. So we've done an amazing job on the mid. We died once, which was on purpose. It's hard to die with this brawler since you have all that range, yet we just spawn back up and we have the gem. So it's going to be two games, one in gem, one in brawl ball, where we basically went untouched and dominated and we didn't even need the star power. That just shows how strong the star power is going to be. Such an essential and good backup. Anyways, we're going to be going on to Siege now. We're going to play a game in Nuts and Bolts, which isn't really a map that's good for him since there's a ton of throwers. But let's hop into it. Let's try and make it work and let's see what happens. Okay, so here we go. And I forgot to change mode. So I guess you guys are just going to get an extra gem grab game. Uh, same comps as last time. I mean, it's just going to be basically the same mindset, which is try and stay alive. And if we do go down, then it's whatever. We have that extra life. But I guess you guys are just getting an extra game, which is pretty OP. You guys always ask for more gameplay. So I guess you guys got what you wished for. We're going to be able to get a super easy kill. And we're just going to march up to these gems over here. We are a little bit too slow to be able to pick them up. But Jigsaw is going to be able to get that kill. We're going to put our boost right here. And now we're going to be even more unstoppable than we already are. Going to move up. 
Now, if you guys are frequently facing 8-bits and want to counter it, I would highly recommend using a Dynamite with Demolition if you have it. It's really, really, really strong against an 8-bit. No way this Mortis can even come close to us. You shouldn't even try. But yeah, it's super, super, super strong. He basically just destroys it because he's so, so slow. Card's going to super that. Pretty OP. He's, <laughs> he's going to tie with the turret. <laughs> Jake's going to be staying alive. He's going to be doing a great job over there. We're going to be able to laser that Jesse. And again, there is nothing this Mortis can do to us. We're just going to move up, get these gems. If this Mortis thinks he can do anything to us, he's just wrong. Going to laser that Rico. Going to try and laser this Jesse. Going to be able to pick up the kill. And we're just going to stand here and spin a little bit of BM with Jigsaw. We're just going to be doing a little bit of auto aiming. Getting that Rico down, lasering that Mortis, and that is going to end another gem grab game. So again, just another really good illustration of how good 8-bit is. It would have been three games with us going down if we didn't even try and purposely die the other time. And again, you're just so strong once you come back to life, especially being in that heat, that bubble where you can't get hit for a little bit. I mean, it's just, it's just too, too good. So we're going to hop over now into Siege for sure. Let's get in that mode and let's get things started. Okay, so here we go into our next game, and we're actually going to be playing Brawly. If you guys don't know IX Brawly, he's a really, really good streamer. Um, one of the nicest guys you're going to see in the Brawl Stars community, so definitely check out his Twitch if you're ever on. He's usually streaming. So we're just going to be on this left side right now, trying to do as much damage as possible, but we're going to be making our way towards the middle. Cart might have a difficult time with this BB over here. Jig is going to go down, and so far the team isn't looking too, too good. We tried to bait out a shot, we weren't able to do so, we're going to go down. But we're going to spawn right back up and be able to get the kill. Even I forgot that we respawn, and I was able to get the kill. That 8-bit definitely forgot, and that was a really, really good example of how powerful that star power is. So again, we're just going to melt this right here. There's no way this is touching the safe. Easy melts, hopefully that tick goes down. He is going to go down, and I mean, just super, super dominant right there. We're going to be able to get some shots off it, but we have to get positioning. Uh, let's see what we can do. Jigsaw is going to be trying to go for that. That BB is going to go towards us. Probably a mistake by that BB. Definitely shouldn't willingly go close to an 8-bit. If you can stay away, definitely try to do so. Jigsaw is going near their 8-bit. Not the best idea in the world. Their 8-bit's trying to go towards me. He's going to be able to get that kill. It's a good kill by him. Um, it looks like it might be a tie. I'm not sure. Okay, we're gonna have a five siege bond. That's actually a bad case scenario since I don't know how much damage we could do here. They do have a pretty strong defense as it looks like. And they have seven, so this is gonna be our only push. Let's see, Jigsaw is gonna have to stay alive there. And we're just gonna have to do as much damage to the safe as possible. Jig's gonna have to jump on it. He's going to jump, and we're just doing as much as possible. We're almost gonna take it out, and we are gonna take it out. Wow. We did so much damage as the 8-bit. Primo died straight away. Obviously, Tick doesn't do that much damage, but we did a ton. And that game was such a beautiful illustration to show you guys how good the 8-bit star power is. You guys saw we're just able to totally just come back to life, get a bolt, which we won by one bolt, which got us that push, which probably changed the game, and obviously get that kill. So that was huge. That's definitely a key moment and something you guys should be looking out for and thinking of when you kill an 8-bit. We're going to hop into showdown here. We're going to see how it goes. First duos, then solos. Let's hop into it. Okay, so here we go into the duo showdown. Now, this obviously isn't going to be an ideal map for us. We're just going to chill over here and get some boxes. Well, OG, uh, no, well, OG, sorry. Well, Jigsaw goes for the mid. So far, we have three. Jigsaw was able to get a couple. I think we're a little bit too slow to rush the mid at the start, so that's why we didn't go there. It appears that there are some brawlers in there. Interesting. Jig's getting into an auto aim battle with them. We're going to be able to take out one. The other Shelly is super low. We almost sniped it to death, but we weren't able to finish it off. Anyways, we have seven right now, so we're looking really good. We're able to pick up a kill over there, and we're close to getting that Leon, but we're not going to be able to do so. Anyways, we're in a really strong position, and if we do go down, it doesn't even matter because we have our... Um, ooh, okay, there's a Piper over there. Because we have our extra life. So it looks like they're going to be pushing us over here. Jigsaw's going to be able to take that down super, super easily. And there is a Piper over here, but that shouldn't be too much of an issue. We're going to be able, hopefully, to snipe it down. I think that's going to be in our range. And that's going to be an easy kill. Three teams already left in the game. We're just going to put this over here for a body block. And try and laser the Leon. We weren't able to do so. Oh, it was just out of our range. Really unfortunate. But I think we're going to be able to get it right over there. Two teams left. And I mean, we're just lasering over here. Absolutely no issues. There's a super weak team over here. They already know they lost. So we're just going to be spinning around. And I mean, literally nothing that they can do. Lasering every single shot. 
Going to be able to take out their turret in a second, their penny in a second. That is going to end the game. That was so unreal. We absolutely dominated with the 8-bit and the Shelly, but mostly the 8-bit. And we didn't even go down. We didn't even get to use that extra life. So we're going to do one more game. We're going to go into solo showdown. I don't know if we're going to rush middle. It's going to be a game time decision. Let's hop into it and let's see what happens. Okay, so we're going to do one more game. We're going to go into solo showdown. Oh, we did duo by accident. I mean, okay. Again, you guys are going to get to see one extra game. You guys are getting lucky this video. <laughs> You guys always ask for extra gameplay, and I guess you guys are getting it today. So what we're doing, I guess we're with two 8-bits, which just seems so unfair. We're just going to walk right up to this. Oh, okay. I thought we were going to go down, but I forgot how broken this brawler was and how much DPS it has. So we're just going to dominate that mid. Unfortunately, our teammate is going to go down. That shouldn't be too much of an issue. We're able to snipe someone right beside us. Oh, we have to get away from that Frank as soon as possible. We're able to snipe it down. And we're just running around, running this game over here. Absolutely dominating. We're going to be able to take this guy down over here. And I mean, we have 13 right now. Our teammate's gone down. We're just running through, lasering everybody. No one stands a chance against us. We absolutely just destroyed that entire game in like 40 seconds. That was unreal. We just walked around, killed everybody. Wasn't even close. I, I, you know what? We're going to count that. I'm sorry. No extra footage for you guys. This is the extra footage. That was basically a solo showdown game. Just put the team on my back and carried. And that's going to be it for the video. So I hope you guys enjoyed. That was some insane gameplay this video. You guys saw some really, really insane plays, some good games, and just some dominating, dominating gameplay. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. It was a really fun video to make. I really love this star power, but it definitely is broken. So if you do get it in your shop, I definitely recommend getting it. One of the best in the game for sure. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. That's going to be it. And I will get another video up for you guys tomorrow. Peace.